ओके चिल्ड्रन नेक्स्ट क्वेश्चन प्रॉब्लम सम ऑफ क्वेश्चन एक्सरसाइज फोर ए इज क्वेश्चन नंबर सेवन अ रूम इज ट्वेल्व मीटर एंड फिफ्टीन सेंटीमीटर लॉन्ग एंड एट मीटर नाइन्टी वन सेंटीमीटर ब्रॉड द फ्लोर ऑफ द रूम इज टू बी पेव्ड विद स्क्वायर टाइल्स मीन्स यू हैव दे हैव टू दे वॉन्ट टू पेव द रूम विद द टाइल्स एंड द टाइल्स मस्ट बी स्क्वाड so find the length of the largest tile that can be used you have to find out the length of one tile which can be used uh, which uh, which must be squared and which can be used in that room write down the statement of question by yourself on your notebook and then we will solve it like this this is the solution of question length of tile length of room sorry which is given 12 meter and 15 cm so the units are given in meter and cm you must change the units into one unit meter or cm here if we uh, change our units into cm we will have no decimal in it so uh this it will be easy for us to solve the question so you can say or 1215 cm so you uh change the centimeters are centimeters you change the meters as 12 multiplied by 100 1200 so 1200 plus 15 gives you 1215 cm so length of room is now 1200 Fifteen centimeter breadth of room is given eight meter and ninety one centimeter, or you can say eight hundred and ninety one centimeter. Now you have same units. with the length and breadth this is length and this is breadth of the room now the greater units are of length so make your debitant as find out the gcd to find out the length of the greatest tile which can be used for the paving in the whole room so the tiles should be of that length all the tiles so we will do the division and get the gcd of or highest common factor of these two quantities so 891 one times is 891 because two times is a greater number from 1215 so do the subtraction 5 minus 1 is 4 11 1 and 0 So I borrowed one from uh, two and make it eleven. Eleven minus nine is two. Now one minus uh, here you are left with one. Uh, so eleven make it eleven. Make it zero. So eleven minus eight is three. Three twenty four is the remainder, and your dividend is the previous divisor. Eight ninety one. Now do the division again. So three twenty four two times two. You can do the multiplication to get the multiple of three twenty four two times four two is are eight two two is are four and two three is are six. So it is a smaller number from eight ninety one. So you can divide it twice. Three twenty four two times is six forty. Eight. Do the subtraction at this step, and you will get eleven here, eight here. Eleven minus eight is three, and eight minus four is four, and eight minus six is two. Two, two forty-three is the remainder or your divisor now, and the dividend is the previous divisor three twenty. So you have to finish both the number by. this uh, cross division uh, so 243 one times is 
3. Now do the subtraction again. 4 minus 3 is 1 and 12 here, 2 here. 12 minus 4 gives you 8. 81. Now make the previous number 243 as your dividend and now eight, you will divide it from by 81 so 81 how many times is 243 let's see 3 times maybe 3 1 is 3 3 8 is 24 is the exact number so 84 uh, 81 3 times is 243 your number is crossed down and the last divisor 81 is your highest common factor. H C F is 81. So what will be the statement? The length of largest tile largest squared tile must be 81 centimeter so this is your seventh question